Edgar, you're not painting anymore? What's up, bud? Hey, how's that painting of Dr. Lobato coming along? You know, I'll deliver it for you as soon as it's finished. Silence! I am conceptualizing. Okay. Well, brace your brain for impact. Hmm. What is this? Are you working on an abstract piece? Nice use of color. That's an impressive house of cards you're building there. And still, not high enough to reach the sky and free her from her prison. Who is she? I only know that she is beautiful. Perfect. And sad. All day she cries rose petal tears. And I can do nothing to help her, because my creation lacks something, and it will not stand against the bull. What bull? El Odio. Somewhere along the way, I feel that I lost something important, but I do not know. I think it's your queens. You want me to go look for them? Bring me any cards you find. I must complete this tower. Yes! Uh <gasps> oh, jeez. Okay. God, are you all right? Poor little guy. Oh my God. Hmm, little Nick on the frame. Uh... Maybe I can cover that up with a price tag or something. Hey, it's me. I love the color scheme in this level, by the way. Enjoy your new art there. Thank you. Wait, I have to carry it? The whole thing? I guess I'll just make my way back. Oh, I see. Enjoy your new art there. Okay, so poor <clears throat> paintings become whatever nice. they are. Now I can get Edgar's cards. Wait, where's my rose? Oh, okay, so now I have an actual rose. That's well, cool. See ya. Keep off the street now. I'll do my best. If I hold the rose, will you think I'm a gentleman? Oh yeah, you will. Ah! Well, what do I do with that? Oh, I can go inside. Ah! Now I'm covered in lipstick. What does that do for me? Hopefully the lipstick doesn't wear off. I need it. What the heck? God, I hate. I need the steamer trunk tag for this guy. Okay. What do I need for her? Something's opening and closing. Oh shoot. Okay. What? I need another rose. Well, I wish I'd known. What do I do now? Do you have another rose painting? <clears throat> hey, have you seen any really big playing cards around here? Now that takes me back. Poker night with the uh, guys. That's why he's a dog. Man, I miss those dogs. 
Uh-huh. So the cards, you know where they are? Oh, right. Well, I do know about these four lost queens, but that's all. Can't do much with four queens, can you? Yes, I can. Those are exactly the cards I need. Where are they? Forget about it. They're guarded by some pretty nasty characters. Not to mention El Podio. You're better off just hanging out here and turning your head just a teensy bit to the left. Where did you say the... Forget about it. Okay, I'm off. of it all. Hey! What's that all about? Excuse me, Mr. or Mrs. Tiger, whoever you are, give that back. Introducing, fresh from the Thrilla uh -oh. in Manila, I'm wrestling. Iowa, Iowa. Tiger! Tiger. Wake up, little man. Time to go nighty night. But if I, I just woke am up. awake. Good, because it is bedtime for you, snake size. What are you talking about? Yeah. You will fight me for my card, yes? Well, I am looking for some cards. Then, small fry, I am afraid the Sandman is going to have to bend way over to reach you because you are so awfully itty bitty. And then. All right, I get it. Just shut up and let's go. Really? <laughs> then I will shut up, but only so I can enjoy the microscopic spectacle of your attempts to make me shut up. Mm hmm. Oh, fuck. What am I supposed to? Avoiding the tiger pounce requires some serious tumbling skills. Not really. I win. Sleep tight, kitty. What's going on? I was standing, we were standing on the card I wanted to grab. Okay, so there's a different card in each portal here. Oop.
A guitar and a rose. Yeah, I saw another dog selling art up the street. Are you guys a chain? Ah, you've met my compadres. When we were young art dogs, we would run wild in the street together. But now... Why don't you guys just make a run for it? You couldn't understand. El Odio imprisons us all. Art is the only escape. And today is the only day that it's going to be this cheap. All these prices go up tomorrow because of tourist season. Hey, can you fight bulls? I have a bull problem. Sorry, artist here, delicate hands. And anyway, if you are talking about El Odio, well, there is of course only one man who could handle that much bull. Who can do it? Who can fight El Odio? I speak of no other than Dingo Inflagrante, the infamous matador playboy. Alas, they would never ask him to help. Not in a million years. Hmm. Why won't they ask Dingo to help? Is he expensive? No, because what happened between him and Edgar? Quite a scandal. Ooh. What? What happened between Dingo and Edgar? Tragedy, betrayal, art, love. Pain. Nothing you want to know about. Come on. Tell me. What's the big scandal? Listen, I deal in truth and beauty, not dirt. But maybe if you had bought some art, then I'd have to come up with some small talk while we're making change and, you know. Gotta go. Be good. Hmm. Pearls before swine. <coughs> what? Nothing. Now then, you will, of course. I do? Yes, a thing of... Oh, there you are. What's important in this piece is not what I painted, but what I did not paint. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hmm. <coughs> Pearls before swine. Okay, I bought some art. Now give me the dirt on Dingo. <laughs> Okay, here's how I heard it. Years ago, when Edgar was a world-renowned painter, he was commissioned by Dingo to immortalize him in black velvet. But while he was sitting for the portrait, Dingo met Edgar's beautiful wife, who was none other than the top flamenco dancer, Lampita Passionado. Okay. He seduced the dancer, and the two ran off together, leaving Edgar with the unfinished painting and a broken heart. Aww. Since then, Edgar thinks of nothing but the treacherous pair. And since then, our streets have been ruled by El Odio. Whoa. That's a great story. You should do a painting about it. Yes, that's what we need around here. Some paintings of dingo and bulls. Yeah. Good idea. I think that dingo sounds like a jerk. Ah, uh, he gets an unfair rap because of his looks. As a collie, I know how hard it is to be resented for your beauty. It's like being forced to wear a golden robe with a diamond kick-me sign on the back. Must be tough. Yeah, I work it out through my painting. Okay, cool. Bye. Gotta go. Hmm. Oh, thank God. I felt like I was being looted. All right, time for another one. What animal is this? I can't tell by the picture. Um, don't know what's in there, and I'm a little frightened. Why are there hearts, though? What's with the hearts? Introducing! Fresh from an astonishing victory at the Killings and Billings. I still don't know what animal this is. Dragon! Oh. Well, that would explain it. I was looking for, like, a feline. Yow! What's that smell? That smells like fear, boy! Yeah, no, I mean that fart smell. That's fear! <laughs> No, I'm talking about an actual smell. It's like if stink bombs laid eggs and then those went bad. 
That's sulfur! Uh, it's part of the dragon costume, kid. Okay. So do I just do the same thing, or is this guy gonna be different? can fly, he'll never beat the Dragon Roar! I win. Soon they'll be dragging your ass out of here. <laughs> hey, are you late? Did you hear that? Aww. All right, two out of four down. Man, I can still smell that guy. Yeah, sulfur stinks. Oh shit, that was a bad idea. Well, I got a pigment at least. Uh... Why back here though? Yeah, let's see what the guitar does. Oh! Well, that's helpful. Sewer. Can I go in there? Ah. Fuck. No! Uh. Why'd you take me back so far? I think that will work. Okay. Nice! Got it! I'm starting to feel like I'm back in high school. Which is weird because I'm only 10. This reminds you of high school? Edgar's Lament. Lana and Edgar. Aww, they were sweethearts. And they were like the stars. He did wrestling. And they were great. So, wait. So, ah, there he is. Oh, so it wasn't exactly the way it was told, but got it. Oh, it's another one of these things. See, I know what to do here now. I already have this one. All right, what's in here? 
Oh, there's two ways up. I wonder if this is a secret because it was locked, whereas the other one was just in the middle of where I... Camp for focusing my energy directly, and now I'll start regenerating my health. Nice. Watch it. No. No. Oh, hey. No. Man. Oh, okay. Wait. There's a hook here. I don't have a painting, but I gotta remember that. Okay. Alright, what's up this way? Not in the middle of the road, am I? No, 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 no. Hello. Edgar Tegley sent me. You know, the famous painter. How about a discount? Famous painter? Edgar? <laughs> yeah, right. You don't give discounts or you don't think he's famous? Look, I'm sorry, but eating lunch every day in the art teacher's room does not make you a famous painter. Anyway, you only did that to hide out from the school wrestling team. Oh, so it was in high school. Hey, there's no shame in hiding from wrestlers. They're trouble, especially the wild animal type. <laughs> oh, what do you mean wild animals? Like dogs, eh? Oh, you got a problem with me now? No, I just meant wrestlers can be tough. I didn't mean you. Oh, you don't think I'm tough now? Why? Because I'm a Dalmatian? Oh, hey, we can't all be St. Bernards and Bulldogs, you know. Has Edgar always had a problem with wrestlers? No way. In fact, he used to be the captain of his high school wrestling team. He took them all the way to the state semifinals one year, and then he... he choked. Cost the team the entire match. All because of... Why did he choke? Did they get him in one of those pile driver things? No. Edgar's girlfriend Lana Panzoni dumped him after the first period for Dean Legrand, the head of her cheerleading squad. Tech League was worthless after that. The other team just tossed him around the rest of the day like a half sack of pork rinds. Oh wow. man. His squad hated him after that. The whole school did. That's not fair. How sad. Especially since it all happened to him again with Dingo and Lampita. Oh my god. Oh, right. Yeah, they exist. Not made up at all, those two. Sheesh. Hey, I got some original Picassos over here if you're interested, by the way. See ya. Yes, run. Run from the horror. Well, maybe you can write it off on your taxes as a loss. A catastrophic loss, even. Enjoy that. <laughs> so I want to go. Don't back. tell anyone who painted these, okay? Okay, why? Okay, I don't want a window in here, so I'm going to assume it's going to be a vine. Cool. going I went too high oh, over here Edgar's love. 
He was in high school with Lana. He was all romantic with her and impressive. Ripped his door off the frickin' locker. Uh, they ate lunch together and did silly stuff. And she was tired. Or cold. She was cold, so he gave her a sweater. And then he gave her a rose. And they kissed. But then she left him. Because she was a teenager. And love doesn't last when we're in high school. Tiger? Hey, I just think it's great that you took that ass kicking I handed to you and turned that defeat into something positive. Like gardening. I feel like I might need those. So, Watch it! Then do anything. What did I need to do there then? The window? It did do something. Where am I going? Whoa! Whoa! Hey. No, take me back! Uh. Oh, a snake. You look pretty jumpy. What's the problem? I'm supposed to paint an ad for the big fight between Dingo the Matador and the town bull. Only, the bull's on a rampage, right through where the painting needs to go. Oh, Dingo the Matador! I need to talk to him! Uh, his apartment's right upstairs. While you're there, maybe you can convince him to take care of the bull. Upstairs? I was just up there. Okay, well, I'll fight him after I fight the snake. Or talk to him after I fight the snake. Next up... Junior King Kong Cobra! Hi. Hey, Edgar. Nice headgear, freak. What? What? You suck, Tegley. You can't beat me. Coach says I can't be beat. Coach says I got mental toughness. You can't break my concentration, wimp. Hey, I'm not Edgar. Yeah? You're gonna wish you're not Edgar when I'm through. Look! I am not Edgar Tegley. My name's Raz. I'm a psychonaut. You're an idiot, Smegley. Coach says your psycho girl crazy lack of focus cost you states. Seriously, I don't want to have to hurt you. Well, since you'd have to break my concentration to even touch me, and since you can't break my concentration, I guess you won't be too disappointed then. So what does that mean? I can't burn him. Okay. No, I can't. Cause I didn't. You can't hurt me at all. Need your analysis on a hostel. What kind? That Cobra wrestler resists attacks. Yeah, that concentration yap he's given don't mean a thing if you can hit him with a nice confusion grenade. While he's trying to remember his name, he's vulnerable. You mentioned this before. How do I use confusion? Helpful. Good luck. Because the... I'm telling you, I'm not, I'm not quite sure. Uh, I'm not remembering being told how to use confusion. Yeah, he kicked my ass, and I didn't even get a hit in, so I'm thinking that this last one right here might be the confusion grenade. So, I'm gonna go further and see if I can find it. Got it! Oh, where's some, uh, dingo? 
There's his bed. A nice little mural in there. Oh, there he is. He's kind of given me, um, uh, oh, what was his name? Ernesto de la Cruz vibes. Ah, uh, you must be the towel boy. You want an autograph? I don't just hand those out. And that's a good lesson for you. Anticipate disappointment. Take me. I'm the greatest bullfighter who's ever lived. Yet my upcoming match against the town bull has received virtually no marketing support. A towering advertisement was supposed to have been painted just outside my window. But as you can see, the job hasn't even been started. I think that bull is trampling anyone who tries to paint on the wall. Maybe you could stop it. Hmm. So instead of challenging the bull before a stadium packed with screaming women, you want me to fight it on the street in front of one dog and one child wearing a crude towel boy disguise. That's a terrible idea. Here's a better one. You go get that billboard painted, and I'll reward you handsomely. Which is how I do everything. Handsomely? As an advance, I'll give you one of my secret weapons. Use it if anyone gets stubborn. Secret weapons? Confusion! Thank you! I got all my merit badges! I can cloud the minds of others using the power of confusion, but if I use it too much, I will need to pick up more confusion grenades to energize the confusing aspect of my mind. Got it! Nice! Try confusion on El Odio. Okay. Oh, I got him. Sweet. Oh, fudge. Hey, uh... go, go, boy. It's not great, but I suppose it's just barely good enough. Come see me if you still want your reward. You know, your advice didn't work. Really? Then here's some new advice. I don't know what you're talking about. How about that reward? Fine then. One autograph. You know, my bulldog Frank could still paint a beer gut on that poster out there. <laughs> All right, here, take this. But I warn you, I won't be able to sign it. Oh, thanks! <laughs> oh, and now that I- okay, so now that I have confusion, I can go fight the snake guy as well. Next up, Junior King Kong Cobra! <laughs> It's 
so maybe if I hit him with my bullets instead of fire? Okay, I have to actually punch him. Okay, okay, so I'm gonna... No, no, that one. That one. Who does he see me as? Little nerdy Edgar! Aww. One confusion when I left. What? Why did you? Fuck, Raz. How do I get more? How do I get more? I don't want him to hit me, but you'll never break my concentration. There, okay. My head will never get all clouded up and confused like yours. Alright, so I just hit him and I get more. Okay. Why? So bad at this, I might lose again. Come on, one more. Yeah, I win. I beat you just like I did in high school, loser. Wait, who am I? Who am I? All right, I've only got one more card left. Thank you. Oh, I keep going, keep going. Yep. Wait. Then no, where's the last card? I'm confused. serious I'm just confused because I only got three I got the tiger the dragon and the snake so that's only three cards I got some cards for you Edgar perfect one step closer to her this one was a real pain in the butt to get ah that is exactly the card I need. I hope these things are worth it, Edgar. Perfect. One step closer to her. Please. Boy, 
I must have those queens. Where's the last one? Let me move. Raz, move. Raz. Raz, move. Raz. Raz. Oh my god, he's not moving at all. Raz. Raz, move. Raz. Raz, none of the buttons are working. I can just move the camera. Raz. Raz, get the fuck up. Raz, move. Please. Oh my god. This is not what I wanted. Raz. Fuck me. Watch it! Uh, oh, that was a waste. Alright, is it over here? There it is! Okay. Shit. Wait, it was here this whole time? I just went the wrong way? Oh, that's right, because I skipped this whole area. When I went in the fucking window. Okay, and it was just down here this whole time. Okay. So what's this? Eagle, it looks like. Introducing, back from a crushing victory at someone might lose a tooth in Duluth, Eagle! Yeah, that's right, it's an eagle. <laughs> Caca! That's it? Caca. Ow! Caca! Jesus! Caca! You also see me as Jimmy Edgar? Oh, you see me as a worm. No loot. Door now. I'm done. Kakai. I guess up there now. Edgar. Here you go, Edgar. The last card. Thank you. You said you would get them, and you did. Not everyone is as true to their word, you know. I know. Well, now you can finish your tower. Yes. Now this can all end once and for all. Wow! It looks like you can walk right up there now, Edgar. Edgar? Edgar? Are you already up there? I 
reach for her. He would save me someday. He just won't let me go. Tell me, how did you kill him? Kill who? El Odio. I didn't. Oh, that's why it has his face. So, Edgar was the bull. Which makes sense, because the Matador was the guy who took his girlfriend. So am I fighting them, or Edgar? Wait. How? How do I defeat El Odio? Oh. El Odio is a fierce, magical creature. He can only be harmed by the traditional bullfighting weapons. Okay. So I'm gonna need telekinesis, right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Edgar. I'm sorry. I don't think this is going to help his mental health very much. For preparing the bull, my humble picador. I shall now finish this beast off easily. Edgar, listen. There is no Elodio, no Lampita, no Dingo. What? You can't let the junior varsity pep squad ruin your life. Um, what's up with the junior? Yeah, we were full on varsity. Yeah. Give me a G. G. Give me an O. O. Give me a B. They stole Give me my a happiness, Give me an L. my life, Give me an the o. state L. semifinals. L. Everything! And that's why it turns into a bull. Okay. No! Wait! Edgar! Ha ha ha! He never learns. Oh, I don't do that butt shake. Alright, so now I have to fight. Oh no! Dingo, right? I can't believe I stuck four of those barbed poles in his back. They're called banderillas. I gotta get those out of there and protect Edgar. If something happens to him while I'm in his mind, I'll get the boot. <laughs> Man. Leave me alone. Can't get a good grip. Fierce, magical creature. He can only be harmed by the traditional bullfighting weapons. Can I hit the matador with them? Can't get a good grip. Elodio is a fierce, magical creature. He can only be harmed by the traditional bullfighting weapons. Better? No! No! Uh, I'm out of the way. Oh, he's getting really hurt. Shit. How do I stop him? I stopped him. Do I hit him with them? Let me try hitting him with the spikes and see if that works. No? Stop! You're gonna kill him! Mm, help me, brother, because I'm gonna lose. He's already past half health and I haven't even hit huh? Dingo. Agent Crawler, do you have any advice on the current situation? Man, get those spears out of Edgar's back. What kind of friend are you? And see if you can confuse that matador. Confusion. Nothing more to report. Crawl around. 
No, throw it at the matador, you dumbass. Oh, stop hurting Edgar, you dick. Oh. No, I confused Edgar. I get extra killed. Can I restart? I feel bad. No, I'm out! I am the mighty El Odio! I have all the power of the bull! Hmm. And all the weaknesses on that. Oh, fix. I have to. Okay. So fire is a no go. Look out! Kick Here comes grip. El Odio! Just do it. Ow! El Odio's here! can't get a good grip. Do it again without letting him hit Edgar once. Do it again without. Ah! Fuck me! Get out of the way. He's gonna hit him. He's gonna hit him. No! Edgar? El odio! Ow! El odio's hit! Watch it! Oh my god, give me confusion! Can't get a good grip. Look out! Here comes Ow! El Odio doesn't like that. Look out! Ow! Right in El Odio's butt! I just No! Fuck us. El Odio is a fierce, magical creature. He can only be harmed by the traditional bullfighting weapons. I'm more confused. Oh, I have it. Okay. What is wrong with you, Raz? I threw it at you, you dick. No. That's good. It's all right. It's okay. We'll win the game some other day. <laughs> uh, shut up, you crying bitch. Edgar, look at them. They're too pathetic to hurt you anymore. Can't you just let it go? How embarrassing. I can't believe I was hung up for so long over these losers. I know. Um, uh, 
I... I always loved you more? Nice. <laughs> High five. We did it. Oh, yeah. Signed, Edgar Tegle. Fini, when you deliver this to my Patronas, you may also hand him my farewell, for I am checking myself out of here. Good for you. You have unchained my mind, young friend. So before I go, I'd like to show my gratitude by painting you a real work of art. No bull. <laughs> you make light of my mental problems, and still, I have no rage. Amazing. Oh, I love it. All right, we got everything we need for Lovato. Let's go just uh, trick Crispin in the next video.